So this is gonna be a pure rant. If those that do not want to hear, please leave now because ah, it's gonna be depressing. Maybe it has to do with the fact that uh, yesterday I slept in, uh, in this BV, as they call it, and uh, it was terrible, guys. I mean, it works and everything, but uh, the humidity and the cold, it's... And the fact that I, I didn't have any um, mattress, you know, obviously. And uh, I, I could sleep like for 10 minutes, 15 minutes at, at best, and then I would wake up, you know. At some point I had some sheep, you know, young, young sheep uh, talking there all night long. And I was hoping they would not see me, otherwise my, that would have been too much. And, and so, uh, by this, I, I had to, when you don't sleep, you, the next day, you completely uh, lose it. And so what I did, I just was able to, to get to the next town, which is called whatever, as, as always. <laughs> just beautiful places, you know, in the mountain. And uh, the only good thing today, guys, was this gift that God gave to me, which is to stay like this. And I also slept a little bit here on, on this rock, here on this rock, and it was pleas pleasurable because uh, there are no mosquitoes, guys, which is something unbelievable. This is the second time. Pisoniano also didn't have mosquitoes, and this place also doesn't have doesn't have mosquitoes. Which is beautiful, guys. Um, so I, I would uh, I would play with this thing because it charges my phone, you know, and I do not do not have to ask to, to, to the dumb sheep there, you know, with a mask, you know, to charge my phone. I just use this. I put wood that I see everywhere, you know. I put it here. And this has a rechargeable battery that with USB that gives energy to the whatever. So I charged my phone and my power bank and so I'll be able to if I can find Wi-Fi free or Wi-Fi there to to connect online. And I just want to say to to those few that comments uh, on these videos that I read all your comments guys and I and I salute you all. The only problem is that I am paranoid about Wi-Fi. For example, when I use Wi-Fi, I like uh, if someone sees me, uh, I look like crazy. I, I just put the phone there, start downloading, uh, just get get away, just leave the phone uh, like 10 meters away. <laughs> and so I, I I'm not able to comment because I would I would have to be connected all the time, and so I don't want to do that. And so. Uh, for example, th there was a comment about uh, uh, maybe the, the name is uh, I, I, with the J, I, I, Joyce or something. Sorry if, if I'm uh, my, my my memory is not uh, good. Uh, you asked if I knew uh, Sean Ross. I have talked about Sean Ross, uh, and I am a great fan of Sean Ross. Fan, like I'm like. Uh, like a friend of his, uh, virtually, so to speak. I have r uh, uh, written him emails and he has answered back also. And when he was the last time in Italy, I was doing a walk just like him, you know. And I almost met him. In fact, if you see one of uh, my last, the, the walk, there is a playlist on my YouTube channel called 1K. At the end, the, the number must be 120 something. I talk about Sean Ross because uh, I managed to uh, contact him. He told me that he was in, in uh, Liguria, which is a region relatively close to where I, where I was at that time in October, in uh, January, sorry, of this year. Uh, and so I, 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 I told him, man, I, I, we, we have to, to meet. And, uh, but unfortunately, uh, he had to, to leave like the next day and uh, 
And I told the unfortunately man I cannot uh, make it with the trains and all the all the travel was too long and I couldn't be in time there. And uh, and, and and it was bad because uh, who knows? It, it's uh, they are making a traveling uh, a luxury now, and um, and so. It, it 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 seems that I will never see him again at this point because he it, it's also hard for, for us guys that do things like this that people for example when you are tired do not take you with, the, with their car for example let's say you know but you know it was fun yesterday a woman picked me up with the with the car uh, and she was smoking but yet she was terrified about the virus guys so it's uh, it's really hard, and I try to tell her to wake her up, and uh, she listened a bit. Yeah. But uh, she uh, made me wear the mask. She said I cannot wear it because I'm smoking, but you should wear it because I prefer so. I said to myself, okay, let's. This is what happens, guys, when when you, when your life is not on your, in your hands. People can do to you whatever they want, and you just shut up. So that's why, you know, you do things like this. You just uh, end up alone by yourself because the sheep are very hurtful, guys. Very hurtful for, with, with, what, with the, what they do. And so I, I was depressed today, guys, because... Uh, and. And, and and this is something which uh, which is true that uh, depression is linked to also to th how tired the, the the mental you are like e even physically when you are tired physically for example when they want to make someone talk uh, when they captured someone and they want to make him talk they uh, stress him so that he would lose that that uh, mind power that you have to to not do the the easiest thing you know which is to just tell it and leave me alone you know and so because i was tired because i slept didn't slept uh, yesterday i was thinking about this uh, situation where you know uh, it appears that you know Although we had internet, we have all this information out there, you know. It just looks like, you know, I was in, uh, in, imagining in, in my mind, you know, this monsters like like a spider, which is slowly coming to you. It just smiles, you know, without, and, and, and it's about to get you, you know. And you, and it's whatever you do, man. Whatever we try to do, you know, it's it's like counts zero all the time. Things always get worse, you know. And uh, for those monsters, you know, that uh, maybe I are checking my channel to see because they they see our reaction, how we react, you know, how our how is our psychological uh, perception of the situation, and they put all this into a big computer, and then that's why they are so perfectly able to to do things all the time with the certainty that it will work. Because they know how to, how much to push, and this monster comes at you. Ah, oh, here I'm coming. It, it doesn't not even speaks. Just comes. Doesn't care. He knows this. Everything will work. Or oh, so it seems. So it seems. So it seems, and uh, the. So it seems. But this is the depression of mine. It's a. Uh, maybe we're doing too little. What's what was the problem here? For in my in my opinion, of course, we're doing truly we We're doing nothing really. But the problem is we are very very few. That that's uh, the thing. That's the thing. And and the more time passes, the worse situation gets. And and instead, you know, of you know things, with time, you know, appear in front of you so clear. When they did also this, you know, to the sheep, and then the sheep will fall for it, fell for it. It, it it just breaks you psychologically, man, and and I and I don't even have the power anymore to to talk to these dummies because it's like you know an adult, you know that uh, 
does something really stupid, you know? And, and, and you, you, you are just speechless at that point. You know? okay, what can you do at that point, man? I just want to slap them also like, like uh, those that are doing all this. How, how can you... It's, it's impossible, man. It's, uh, that's why it's, it's really depressing, all this. So, uh, maybe if something lighter comes when I go there now, I'm recharged now. I, I took all day to, to be here because it's a nice spot. Even though it doesn't look from the phone, the phone and it's, it's resolution also. I lower it a lot when I edit. Uh, so this phone really sucks for resolution, but it's not important. The important thing is the message there. Uh, so I wanted to recharge myself because otherwise I would not be able you know, to, to go there now. And so I have like uh, one hour to go there. <laughs> Look where is the town, guys? Up there in that mountain there. As you can see, it's called. Again, whatever. <laughs> I mean, really, what's the meaning? They put names of saints in the in the towns here in Italy, guys. This one is called um, Rocca Santo Stefano. So Rocca is like a rock, you know. Santo Stefano is Saint St Stephen. Stephen? Yes, Stephen. Um, so this, everything is holy here, guys. Everything is holy, but the people. <laughs> Except the people. So, let's see what happens there, guys. And, and uh, if something better than this rant happens, I will put that and I will delete this. Let, let, let's hope I will not have to sleep again in the BV, guys. And um, something... And you know, I'm, I'm not doing this just, you know, so that I can walk you know, and enjoy nature. I, I, I'm not even able to enjoy nature at this point, guys. I'm doing this, as I've said, this is an exodus. You know? so I'm trying to... And I suggest this to all of you guys, please consider, you know, doing this before autumn. Because when they will hit us with this other wave, you know, you will not be able to, to, to get out of those hell, of those huge cities, for example. They will, they will make hell, guys. So, at least you try. You just get out of your uh, a huge town if you live in a huge city and, and see what happens. You know, and then you decide you can come back again. You know, so that's what I'm doing. I'm trying to uh, not be in Rome, so that I'm checking these places. I'm watching if there is a place where I can stay, for example. You know, whatever place for me it's good. Uh, just as long as it is not Rome, Rome. So that's it. Let's uh, let's go there now. So guys, I ended up in uh, in this Franciscan uh, church uh, there, where I was uh, staying in, in that town. There, they didn't uh, they didn't have any. The priest, you know, was didn't wanted me there. Uh, didn't give me the space to sleep, and so uh, as many times as have happened. Uh, the people of the of the, that manage the city, uh, like the mayor, you know, uh, were kind enough to to take me to this other place here, uh, which is like uh, some satanic shit, guys. Yeah, uh, usual monsters, guys. You know? They they make they make them. Uh, these are Franciscan, you know, all male, you know. They make them uh, not marry. Uh, then you wonder why they go with uh, the children. Anyway, and l let me not let me stop here because <laughs> there would be, but these people will pay anyway. So uh, after this guy, you know, uh, was a bit, you know, didn't like too much the idea, but thankfully the woman from the commune of that town came with me here and she talked because if I was alone maybe this monster would not accept me and so uh, what happened is uh, of course she came out as a dumb with a mask and everything you know like this and of course
course, I don't wear the mask. And uh, he agreed. Agreed to let me sleep here. In this, in this angle here. There is a table here. You know, for me it's not a problem, you know. It's much better than, than yesterday, you know. And uh, he also, like, seemed to, to, to mean that uh, he would bring me food also, but anyway, guys, it's, it's, it's already a miracle to be alive in this system, guys, with these monsters. So, for me, it's okay. So guys, if nothing else, this reptilian do not eat me, you know, or attack me. If nothing uh, funny like that happens, it's me and the uh, reptilian building here with the triangular, you know, Masonic uh, front here. Salute you. Bye bye.